Rebecca Burns here with a video production riddle. What is 4096 by 2160, a thousand to one contrast ratio with a 10 bit RGB panel? Gary, is this monitor meant for the field or the edit suite? It's intentional for the field. The whole design of this actually is for on-set work and working in a 4K workflow uh, on set. Um, the big advantage that we have with this is uh, we're looking at it as more than just a monitor. Uh, out on set, you have a lot of issues with cables and bringing equipment and portability. Um, what we've done here is we've taken a systematic approach to this, and now I've included the recorder in the monitor to clean things up and make it easier to put this production together. Can you explain a little bit about how it is a production system? Um, yeah. Instead of having a separate recorder and a separate equipment that you normally would have on your cart out on set, we've included the player into the monitor. So what the player does is take a standard uh, S by S card, uh, Pro Plus card, and what it can do is record uh, 4K AVAC uh, right onto the card. So uh, you have the recorder built in, you can run the recorder from the control panel, and you can eliminate having these extra wires and uh, other things hanging out that can fail. How does this product compare with other 4K monitors coming out now at NAB? Uh, probably the first thing it's delivering. Uh, I don't think anybody else has anything out there in, that is actually being tried or is out in, in use. Well, 4K right now is, is really just starting off, so uh, uh, it still has a 4K price to things. Uh, this model right now is uh, $35,000. It seems like on our online community that most of them use HD monitors on their 4K production. So we want to know, how does 4K monitoring rate on your priority list? Read my lips and share this video. So where do you download information over Drive? Go to Cruise Control's website and click Podcast.